Hello, my name is Michael. I'm a solutions engineer at Vercata, and this video will cover how to create alerts in Vercata Command. Alerts allow you to be proactively notified when events happen in an area monitored by your Vercata devices. All of your alerts are managed in the Alerts menu. Access it by clicking on the bell icon in the bottom left corner of your screen. Create a new alert by clicking on the New Alert button. In the New Alert window, you will see all of the available alerts you can create for your Vercata devices. As an example, let's create a person detection alert for one of our cameras. Click on People and Vehicle Detection from the list of alerts. Click on Cameras. Click on Individual Cameras. Select the camera or cameras you want to monitor for people and click Done. Click on Motion Type. Select People and click Done. Click Setup next to Motion Areas. And click Use Full Frame Motion Area. Click Recipients. By default, you are added as an email recipient of a new alert you create. You can select additional users to notify by searching for their user in the search bar. Click on email to the right of the user to select how to notify the user. Users can be notified by push notifications to the Vercata Command mobile app, email, or text message. You can also have the alert be visible on the user's alert page without actually sending a notification. Finally, you can remove a user as a notification recipient by clicking the delete button. Only users that have verified their phone number can receive text alerts. Click done when you've added all of your alert recipients. Click on the notification schedule to select when you want to monitor for the specified alert condition. By default, alerts will be generated 24 hours a day, seven days a week. To remove the default schedule, click the X button next to each day of the week. To create your own schedule, click and drag your cursor over a day and time you want your alert to be active. You can edit the time and days in the window that pops up. Click Done when you are finished adding this block of time. You can create additional monitored times by repeating this process. When your schedule has been configured as you like, click Done. If you have a Vercata BZ11 horn speaker, you can configure it to play a message when an alert is triggered. Click on Device Action. Click on the search bar beneath Select Horn Speaker to select the horn speaker you want to use for the notification. If you would like to type a message to be spoken from the speaker, ensure Text to Speech is selected and type your message in the field below. You can also have the speaker play an audio file. Select Audio File. Drag and drop the audio file into the window or search the audio file by clicking Choose a File. Click Done when you are finished. Click Next if you are satisfied with your alert configuration. Enter a name for your alert and click Done. You should now see your alert in the column to the left of the alert window. If you would like to change an alert, hover your cursor over the alert and click on the ellipses to the right of the alert's name. You can mute the alert to halt notifications for a period of time. You can star the alert so it's easier to find in a long list of alerts. You can edit the alert to reconfigure it. Finally, you can delete the alert to remove it from the system. To learn more about creating alerts for specific use cases or Vercata products, see the help article linked in the description. That's all for this video. Thank you so much for watching. As always, don't forget to check out our knowledge base or contact our 24-7 support for further questions.